After dressing the big buff, Jared was back in the hunt. This time he's changed weapons and went for his cold steel Zamburu spear. Thousands of years before, as with Jared, his ancestors waited with spear in hand. The bull has no idea that death is perched above. This, these thing animals are amazing. He's gotten such a distance, even though he's been speared. So, but the blood's picking up. He should be pretty close. Hold on. Yeah, he's dead. He's dead. He's right there. The spear's still in him. Oh, it's freaking awesome. <laughs> yeah. This is freaking awesome. Oh. Oh. I want to swear right now, but I can't. Again, we got a little primitive on it. We went back Native American style with an old spear. It's the only way to hunt. I'm addicted now. Hunting with spears. All you bears out there, watch out. You're next. You got the juggler or something. Oh, yeah. Boomer, over here. Come oh. here, bud. Now elk and buffalo are hunted where they once roamed thousands of years ago. <sighs> oh, yeah. You know, obviously you don't have wild elk running out in the middle of central Illinois without high fences, but this is a pretty big preserve. And, um, you know, we just came back from from doing some wolf hunting up in Canada and on the way back home to Arizona decided you know I need some red meat because I start training here soon and why go buy it when you can go hunt it and uh, to make things better we use our uh, cold steel spear and it's been a long three days out here I tell you what it's been a long three days and uh, finally got one under us I can't wait to get back cook up some back straps and, uh, and hit the weights so I tell you what this has been a hell of a time everybody here at Trophy Ridge is amazing the guides were great, put me in the right spots, and whew, let me take a look at this beauty. You know, I, I'm a little worried about Jared. He's a little reckless. You know, he's kind of got that uh, cowboy outlaw personality. And uh, due to the $100,000 in fines he received this year through the National Football League, I thought for my own safety that I should come out with the hard hat in case on the drawback of the spear, the other side happened to poke me in one of the holes. <laughs> and I was like, all I could think about is don't miss, don't miss, don't miss. It was hard for me to watch the elk. I had to, I had to zoom in <laughs> on you and try to get clear because I wanted to see that, that new patent and stance oh, that you're creating. New patent, uh, <laughs> you know, the first time I'd thrown a spear at an animal, so I was, I was a little nervous. I was excited, my adrenaline was rushing, because I never believed that we'd be right on top of him like that, you know? Big bull down. Still got the adrenaline, still shaking a little bit. <laughs> 